Welcome to Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs, Make Your Mark. Filling in for Dave Palumbo, I'm Sadiq Faruqi. It's Thursday, March 24th, 2016. Let's find out what's going on in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. After being sidelined for the entire 2015 season following knee surgery, it looks like former Olympian and NPC National Bikini Champion Jennifer Dawn is back to work. This week, Dawn leaked some footage from a recent training session where we see the Texas native looking a whole lot like her old pre-injury self. If we hopped into the DeLorean and flashback just a few years ago, we'd see that Dawn was routinely one of the busiest athletes in the sport, competing all over the map in just about any show she can get her hands on. And if she can find a way to get back to herself and stay injury free, it's hard to imagine her not getting bitten by the competition bug again sometime soon. Two weeks removed from putting on yet another impressive performance in his first career Arnold Classic appearance, rising men's physique superstar Ryan Terry is back on the grind. Earlier this week, Terry was spotted grinding his way through a brutal circuit training session as he attempts to kick things into high gear, again following his fourth place finish. The former British national champion was one of the real breakout stars of the men's physique division in 2015, and so far here in 2016, he doesn't seem to have any intention of slowing up the pace one bit. At his best, Terry is without question one of the top six physique athletes in the world right now, and if he can take some time off to add a few new wrinkles to his game, it shouldn't surprise anyone to see him slowly working his way up the rankings. If you're one of the last few surviving climate change deniers, I dare you to take one look at this sizzling new footage from IFBB bikini sensation Yorishna Ayala and tell me that the global temperature didn't just climb a few degrees. After deciding to sit out the entire 2015 season, Ayala seems to be heading into this year's contest season with bad intentions. Judging by what we've seen from her lately, Ayala has really been doing her homework and comes into this year looking better than we've ever seen her. If she can just manage to find that delicate balance of fullness and conditioning, look out, because she is going to be a major problem when she hits the stage. Somewhere deep down inside, don't all of us wish we were a little bit more like Branch Warren? A little over two weeks after bringing home yet another top five finish at one of the sport's most prestigious events, Branch was spotted back in the gym doing Branch Warren things, like grounding out a few sets of dips with a maniacal intensity straight out of a Gotham City horror story. I'm not sure how he does it, but Branch just keeps chugging along as one of the best in the sport despite being over the age of 40 and battling through a myriad of injuries throughout the span of his career. With the Arnold Brazil slated to take place about eight weeks from now, it seems like it would be a great place for Branch to show up unannounced to get in there, clean house, and get out before anyone even knew what hit them. And that does it for another episode of Muscle in the Morning brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. Make your mark. Filling in for Dave Palumbo, I'm Sadiq Farooqi reminding you to keep it locked to rxmuscle.com and the Muscle Central Forum. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Have a nice day.